We now head over to Aglal, who is in New Haven this morning after an eight month old baby was found in a dumpster. This was such an awful story. We first broke to you at four o'clock. We know a woman is in custody this morning. Aya is live right outside New Haven Police Headquarters. Thankfully, the baby is in stable condition that we do know. But Aya, what do we know about the suspect? Nicole, well, the 24-year-old woman, she's from Hamden. Police say she is not the mother of that eight-month-old baby. She is set to face charges in connection with this case. Police say she left the baby inside of the dumpster, and now investigators are trying to figure out what exactly happened, but their relationship is unclear. A disturbing discovery at the Presidential Gardens apartment complex on Dixwell Avenue. An eight-month-old baby found in a dumpster outside this New Hallville building Monday afternoon. The infant was first found by a tenant throwing out the trash. The tenant notified this eyewitness, and they removed the girl from the dumpster, then called police. Basically coming out of shock. You can tell she was freezing freezing in that trash. Police rushed the baby to Yale New Haven Hospital. Investigators say the eight month old is being treated for burns to both hands. Detectives determined a 24 year old Hamden woman put the baby in the dumpster. But right now, police say they are still trying to figure out who is responsible for the child's injuries. So we do know that police are in touch with the baby's mother. Now, as far as the 24-year-old woman facing charges in connection with this case, we do not yet know her identity, nor do we know what charges exactly she is facing. She is set to appear before a judge and be arraigned later on today. So as soon as we learn any new developments, we'll bring them to you on air and on the Channel 3 app. We're live outside New Haven Police Headquarters this morning. Aya Glau, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.